Look at us. We are dressed to kill and moving like greased lightning. We sit astride 1400 cc of motoring menace, showered, shaved and smothered in deodorant, ready to hunt down our latest quarry. Yes, we are about to face the carpet cleaners. Are you serious? We're going to go through all this trouble to catch carpet cleaners? Yep. We should leave this one to Annie in the studio. Nah, she's got laminate flooring everywhere. She can't stand the dust. Anyway, these are no ordinary carpet cleaners. They are masters of the bait and switch. Master switches. And baiters. So what's that then? Well, Dan, let me explain. Bait and switch is a classic wheeze for selling goods and services of all kinds. First off, you get an attractive offer, like... A new motorcycle for 500 quid. Wow, you think that sounds great. But it turns out that the 500 quid bike is not all it might have been. Yeah. Too late. You've taken the bait. You're hooked in and a salesman is intent on focusing your attention on something at a much higher price. This works because you can feel duty bound to buy something. Especially if it's a persuasive salesperson. And it works so well, the government has made it illegal. Tonight's company doesn't sell motorbikes, they sell carpet cleaning services. But Enterprise Cleaning Services UK Limited of Wimborne in Dorset employ the same bait and switch technique. It all starts off with an offer of £8.99 to clean two carpets. They offer to clean furniture too, also for a low, low price. Alison Hughes of Limington in Hampshire wanted this sweet clean, so when a leaflet from Enterprise dropped through her door... I rang them and said, could they do two chairs? And they said, yes, as well as the sofa, for a small extra amount. Mrs Hughes had taken the bait, and when the Enterprise cleaner came to call, it was time for the switch. He said... Well, no, it's just a very second-rate cleaning system, but our chemicals are amazing. So I was intrigued, and I thought, well... If I'm spending sort of 30 altogether, maybe a little more to have the chemicals. So I said, oh, how much are the chemicals? And he said, well, he said, oh, for so from one chair, it would be, be getting on for 350. I said, well, what? And then um, I said, well, the two chairs. And he said, well, 400. And I said, but, you know, why did you put a leaflet through the door at such an inexpensive price? And the price kept climbing. Mrs Hughes was also persuaded to pay £100 to protect her suite from new stains. It just evolved that suddenly to have this extra would be amazing and, you know, your furniture would be brand new or look brand new. I'm just absolutely almost ashamed of myself to think that you know, when he came, I was thinking, well, it would be 30, 35, and by the time an hour and a half had gone, I'd, I'd parted with literally 500 pounds. And I just thought, how did that happen? How indeed. But, Mrs Hughes, if only you were alone. You see, Enterprise Cleaning Services UK Limited is a booming business. They have five branches and say they have 90 employees. They also say they've made more than 26,000 house calls. Three quarters of them end up buying more than the 899 clean, which many of them initially signed up for. So it isn't just the gullible who fall for this technique. And if you've been had by it, you shouldn't feel ashamed or guilty. You see, bait and switch works big time. You get it? Yeah, I get it. There should be a law against this bait and swizzle thing. Well, you know what? There is. Prohibited Act Number 6 of the Consumer Protection from Unfair Trading Regulations 2008. He carries a copy everywhere. Yeah, well, somebody needs to know what they're talking about. Now the bit where we get a house and some secret cameras. Look at that. We've made sure it's got carpets. That's important. And there's an old lady to walk around on them. We've also got an expert, Mark Weston, commercial lawyer extraordinaire. He has seen the footage. And we have pre-taken the bait. I'm uh, interested in this um, deal you've got for eight ninety nine for two rooms. OK. Now it's time for the Enterprise Masterclass. Three steps to sales success. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, right, this is the room I want done, OK? Yeah. Bait and switch step one. Get the more expensive product that you really want to sell in front of the client. What I'll do, I'll grab my machine, 
come in, put down two test patches for you. Oh, test patches? Yeah. Oh, nothing to worry about. Just see what, put down two levels of cleaning for you. Why two test patches, unless you're planning to offer something over and above what you came there to actually sell? I'm going to do a, a deep clean and a maintenance clean. So you can I see, see the difference I between see. the two. Mm -hmm. I mean, what is the difference then? I don't... Maintenance clean, we just use the tool. With a deep clean, we use this, which is a preconditioner. Mm -hmm. It softens the pile of your carpet and starts to break the dirt mm. down. Why isn't he getting on with the service that he promised her? Sales patter is fine, but this is going beyond that. Well beyond. What Enterprises man Chris Cooper has done is told us that for the 8 99 clean, they don't even spray any shampoo on your carpet first. Funnily enough, he can offer a much more effective cleaning service this very day. It might just cost our old lady a little more than she was expecting. I've included that all in for you mm -hmm. for one six seven ninety. And if you're struggling with the maths, that's more than 18 times the price they originally promised to clean her carpet for. Yes, inflation is well and truly back, as will we be in about 15 minutes.